only got one birthday wish, and that's to get my, my, my wife back, Cardi. You know what I'm saying? We're going through a lot of things right now, a lot of things on the media. I want to apologize to you, Cardi. You know, I embarrassed you. I made you look crazy. Doing things, I ain't had no business. I was partaking in activity that I shouldn't have been taking in. And I apologize, you know what I'm saying? Breaking your heart, breaking our promise, breaking God's promise, and and being a, a, a selfish, messed up husband, you know what I'm saying? I'm trying to I'm I'm trying to be a better person. I wanna get this off my shoulders, I wanna get this off my back. I apologize to you, Cardi. I love you and culture. I wanna spend Christmas with you. I wanna be able to spend the rest of life my life with you. I apologize, I'm sorry for what I've done to you. I didn't fuck that girl, but I was entertaining. You know what I'm saying? I apologize. And I love you. I hope you can forgive me. My birthday wish is just to have you back. What the fuck is right now? Ah! Stop. 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 I'm sorry, bro. At first, in front of the world, I love you. Whatever I got to do, show you, bro. I love you. I love you, bro. I love you, bro. I love Let's get this started. Keep going. Let's get this show started. And you know, I really don't. Even though, like, me on the right page right now, we're not seeing each other eye to eye. I don't want people talking crazy about him because at the end of the day, that is my child's father. He's a good father. And he was a good friend to me. And when niggas was doing fucked up shit to me, my baby father helped me in a lot of things. When people was fucking um, practically robbing me, my baby father helped me with a lot of shit when I was pregnant. And I didn't have nobody to help me to like schedule, um, schedule um, studio time and everything. Cause I was so used to somebody else doing it for me. My baby father was helping me. So I don't wanna kick, um, I don't want people talking shit about my baby father. I know he's trying hard, cause I get it. It's December. I get it. We have a daughter. I get it. We don't. We haven't seen each other. I get it. We're not speaking to each other. So I get it. I get what he's trying to do and everything. I don't like how people is like, you know, talking about it, like manipulative or album, but this and that. The niggas not even dropping his album this month. So cut it out with that shit. That's one. This is what happens, I guess, when shit turns sour in relationship. You know what I'm saying? But I don't want, like, I, even though I'm hurt and I'm, like, going through a fucked up stage right now, I don't want nobody fucking talking crazy about my baby father neither because, like, that's rich. And I smack bitches and I'll fuck niggas up. I'll, I'll bury a block for my, my, my homie, like, that, my baby father, period. I don't give a fuck. And I'm a little upset, you know what I'm saying? Because it's just been a very long, what, it's about to be two weeks. And I'm so tired of the bullshit. And I, I get it. I get it. I get it. I totally get it. Like, I'm not going to let fucking whack-ass bitches, bum-ass bitches, that fucking, that, <coughs> that nigga, they don't... I'm not gonna let fuck ass people disrespect 